Not only Sister Patricia do I have to wait, but I got to watch everybody else around me enjoy theirs. And I'm trying to figure out, I was in the same neighborhood when the ice cream man came. How did I not get my ice cream? Anybody ever been there? Anybody ever been there that you ran outside a little too late to catch the ice cream truck and you went to hey, hey, hey. Come on, And he gone. Can't hear you because the music lies with you. He gone. And so we find ourselves today in places like this where God promises us things. God has made so many promises over our lives, but then he says, but it's for this time. It's for that time. It's for this time. I told God, I said, you know what, God? And this is how I talk to him. Me and him have this relationship, Mr. Brendan. I told him, I said, I'm really frustrated with you right now. Because not only did you tell me what I could have, but you showed me where it was. Yes. And when I went to go get it, it rejected me. Yes. You told me I can have, you told me what kind of car I can have. You told me to go get it, but when I got to the plot and I filled out the loan application and I'm just so encouraged because God told me I can have it. And so I went to the lot and I walked around it five times and I spoke a word over it and agreed and declared that it was mine. I went and visited the house and I walked up and down the stairs in the house and, and the lady was looking at me crazy and showed me the house because she's like, what is this fool doing? And I'm walking, I'm saying, God, it's mine, it's mine, it's mine, it's mine. Lord, I went in the master bedroom and just laying on the floor and said, God, it's mine, it's mine. I even told the lady, excuse me, I got to use the restroom in my new master restroom because I knew it was mine. Now all of a sudden, I feel like a paperwork and they tell me I'm denied. Yeah. Yeah. So right there, you feel like you've been humiliated by God, really? God ain't got time to play games with you. I prayed, mother, and I told him, I said, God, you should not have even shown me. You shouldn't even show me because surely if it's mine, I can have it. Yes. Surely if my name is on it, I can have it. Yes. We have a song this morning, and it's my third song that I shall have when I can agree. And it says, yes, I believe because it belongs to me. And so I'm going to tell you, yes, Joseph, that's your iPad, but you can't use it right now. Yes. Why? Wow. Yeah. It's mine. And so sometimes, in waiting, in waiting, in waiting, in waiting, in waiting, we get tired, we get frustrated, we get mad, and you won't tell the truth about it because people have taught you that you're not supposed to question God. And, and I don't know about you, but I'm going to be real with y'all today. I get angry with God when they tell me I can have something. I know that he's sorry, and I don't pull him down into my carnality, but I get frustrated and say, Lord, what really?